How to find your freight class in under two minutes. Steve's new to his company's shipping department. His new company ships lots of products of various weights, shapes, and sizes. Let's see how Steve handles this freight scenario. Hmm, yesterday I sent out 2,000 pounds of down feather pillows and it was pretty easy. Let's see what I have today. Ah, 2,000 pounds of bowling balls. They weigh the same. I guess I can use the same freight class. Silly Steve, just because two shipments may weigh the same doesn't mean they cost the same to ship. When selecting the right freight class, all shapes, sizes, and densities matter. 2,000 pounds of pillows occupy way more trailer space than the bowling balls. When booking a freight shipment, the first question you'll be asked is what is the class of your shipment? Clearly identifying the right freight class on your shipment will guarantee you the best possible rate from Freight Center without any costly surprises for you or your business. To properly classify your freight shipment, it's important to know the National Motor Freight Classification Code, or NMFC, of the item you're shipping. Everything you ship from bowling balls to down pillows has its own NMFC code, and each code takes into account each item's density, stowability, handling, and liability classifications. Different types of freights have different costs associated with them, based primarily on their value and density. There are 18 possible freight classes ranging from class 50, the least expensive, to class 500, the most expensive. If you're like Steve and are having trouble figuring out the correct NMFC code for your shipment, give one of Freight Center's logistics experts a call today. 